field work. In commemoration of the discovery of the remains of 67 African Americans interred beyond the walls of the University Cemetery, University of Virginia. And it begins with an epigraph that excluding students, enslaved African Americans were the largest of pre-Civil War population residing at the academical village. Remove topsoil, cater close to the principle of uncovering both common and uncommon past. Monitor closely ensuing slow dig and soft brush stroke, now inherent tools of this body of knowledge, intending to reveal whatever of human society remains to be revealed beneath, below, tin wood and brick, ceramic ware, long anonymous cloth, and bits of iron, nail, spindle, and spoon, tooth, quarry stone, bone and shard, men, women, children, useful things of everyday life beneath, beyond, Cemetery, no doubt in other languages, also is a graceful word. Death we know, and sometimes causes, multiple causes of said deaths. Burial means or styles of conveyance to places of burial of those dead. Measuring proximity of bodies, singly and adjacent or cutting one upon another, tell something of various indicators of long time burial practice in specific or approximate or conjectured place. Cumulative patterns of expression and material culture of souls, however, is an area with which neither this present an ongoing study, nor any science we yet know of, claim so far to be equipped to deal. Interviews with known or presumed descendants can perhaps expose basic knowledge of belief, practice concepts of death, desire, afterlife, beyond. Slaves here are called servants. Many who write and talk such things do say that Mr. Jefferson himself did call it so. It does not change the conditions under which we labor within these bounds, the uses we are put to, the ways we die for keep of these grounds. Did call himself father to all this we build and tend. Did look on slavery, they like to tell, as but one necessary evil. Did not say the others. War may happen. In our way, it is as children gone with tetanus, and pneumonia, women go birthing, strapping men fell down in typhoid or the consumption. Violet, William, and boy Bacchus, Tessa's Hannah, Vanity smothered, sleeping. We all did hope, strong Mike 
and Billy, Tom, young and handsome, then bloated over with the filthy bile. Linus old, but also here with us, and not alone. Eliza and baby Eliza, almost together, woman over Broadus' place, some over Maupin, and peril way. Unknown, they write, and put away in ledger and book. Unknown, but not to those who love and tend them in the end. Not by us, not by rust red earth, soft brushed by hands that carry and tend, and sometimes pray, sometimes not. As much science as we now possess, it is yet difficult to advise beyond further study. Determination for remains other than ancient, bearing far more upon the living than we are at present prepared to suppose. 67 is no small number, nor is the body neither less nor more than the souls and others the many. Some return straight away to ancestors, while others live on, even as the body itself gives way. Such knowledge comes in those earliest nights, when living and dead go to meet one another, go out of an evening to sit and talk, good talk. These things are sacred. And it is worse than wicked to disturb those going to talk well with their own grave evil to prevent them from keeping good company with their own dead. In this place, here is wickedness unimagined, except to those who have no soul, no dead to call home no ancestor to guide and receive them. 67 is no small number, and no one of us can make a home where ancestors do not also live. It is well to consider that research design is one language, reverence, another. It is well to consider how further study in concert with broader, nearer communities than these esteemed colleagues may impinge upon the potential weight of disinterment, of removing for analysis at this time remains largely anonymous, yet long consigned. Drums yet may beat soft and low. Texas Hannah, Billy, Strong Mike, beat soft, beat low. William, Tom, young and handsome still. Bacchus, Violet, beat soft, beat low. Liza and baby Liza, old Linus rooted deep as cypress close by, surveying beyond what all remains of this green embowered wood, sweet sleeping Vanerie, waking only to dream again. Feast days to come, be soft, be low, the evils of this place, hardly more than memory trailing, and neither slave nor servant then, but as we are, in these our truest skins, together, 
song now and more inside this silty red and plain soil. Thank you very much.